Cody Bellinger hopes to be ready for opening day. Who's going to replace Kika Hernandez in the super utility role? And a couple of young arms are already impressing this spring. All that and more, I'm Juan Toribio, live from my hotel room here in Arizona, and you're watching Dodgers Daily Basis. Cody Bellinger met with the media for the first time since undergoing arthroscopic surgery to his right shoulder over the offseason and the star outfielder says he's ready to go, he's ahead of schedule, and he hopes to be ready for opening day. Bellinger hasn't taken any swings outside of the cage yet, but he hopes to do so next week. If everything goes according to plan, the plan is for Bellinger to play in Cactus League games by March 15th, which should put him in line to be the team's starting center fielder on opening day on April 1st against the Rockies. One thing he joked he won't be doing anymore? Form bashing his teammates after a home run. Same, Cody. Same. With Kike Hernandez no longer in town, the Dodgers are looking for someone who will be willing to play all over the field, and two of those options are Chris Taylor and Zach McKinstry. Taylor's been with the team since 2016, was a key part of the championship team in 2020, playing a lot of second base. This season, however, Taylor's going to get the majority of his reps at second base, but he will play shortstop, the outfield, and even a little bit third base, according to manager Dave Roberts. McKinsey is also capable of playing multiple positions, including second base, shortstop, third base, and both corner outfield spots. When asked what his goal for this spring was, he said it was simple, make the opening day roster. The more gloves he carries in his baseball bag, the better chance he'll have. Two young arms were impressed on Wednesday during live batting practice were Dustin May and top pitching prospect Josiah Gray. May lit up the radar gun hitting 101 miles per hour according to manager Dave Roberts and featured a pretty good changeup to some good lefty hitters. The key for May this season is going to be to find a way to get more swings and misses and the changeup might be the best way to get there. As for Gray, the young right hander featured a really good fastball and a couple of nice breaking balls and he did that in front of Andrew Friedman, Dave Roberts and David Price who were sitting in on his live VP session. Gray will likely start the season at AAA, and it's unclear if he'll make his debut in 2021, but one thing is certain, as Dave Roberts put it, he's coming quickly. And that'll do it for this episode of Dodgers Daily Basis. I'm Juan Toribio, thanks for watching. And for all your baseball news, make sure to go to MLB.com and watch MLB Network.